Right then, so we're off. We're off on our first trip, aren't we, Enki Man? Whoop -hoo. Whoop -hoo. We're travelling again, and as you see, we can probably see where we're on our, our camper. So we're heading uh, about 30 miles north, I suppose, is it? I don't know, north and all that. No, you don't. Finish, <laughs> but anyway, we're going um, towards Hereford, and we're going to Luxor Carolina Camping Park. So, uh, yeah, so that's exciting. It is yeah. exciting. Yes. So, so let's go. Let's go. <laughs> number nine. So that's what we're up to. One way. It's big isn't it? Wow look how many people here. That's what we'll be doing today aren't they? Doing some sitting down. Yeah. And bugger all then. Sit you down and bugger all then. Yeah. Is that a new term? That's a technical term. So now we're here, and as you can see, Nat and Al, our travelling companions, are already here. And Paulie's doing the most important thing: is he's doing what are you doing, Annie? Look at that! Look at that! Spot on! Oh my gosh! Woo! Got to have a level van. Why do you have to have a level van, Paulie Morgan? Because everything. Well, when you don't roll it up, when you don't <laughs> roll it <out> a bed, <laughs> and uh, things like your fridge. Will always work better if the van's level. Yeah. The most important things we've got in here is a bottle of Villa Maria and some Thatcher's Haze. <laughs> oh, and some more. You're hiding it everywhere, look. Put our legs down so we don't bounce around in bed, Paulie, innit? Well, that's right, and you know, who knows what sort of bouncing around you can get on like that. Do you need your glasses? Sorry? Did you need your glasses? Yeah, we can get it on the old. Yeah, it was a very good effort, was it? <laughs> that's before I've had a drink. <laughs> It's what? It's a bit out that way, yeah. Is it? Yeah. Oh, so we're not all level, you know, all excited. Yeah. We're a bit topsy turvy. Yeah. So try and straighten up. Purely held down with a bit of tape. 
Because that keeps breaking off, doesn't it, Paul? Well, I don't want to cast aspersions on our next door neighbour. <laughs> they blo broke that flap off about four times now. But they're very nice neighbours. They are lovely neighbours. Yeah, they're lovely neighbours. Apart from breaking my but flap. <laughs> uh, Find our electrical point now. You should put your glasses on, Paulie. The little one at the bottom. But you can see it's that way. That's it. <laughs> Paul doesn't like wearing glasses, but he can't see without them, which is a bit of a problem, Paulie Morgan, isn't it? I only need them for seeing. Yeah, I only need them for seeing. Oh, dear. It doesn't look level, no. But it's, it is, obviously. Right. It's time to put the lid on the waste water tank because the last time we used the camper we were in the middle of a field and it didn't matter if the water just ran out because it was only washing out water after all but obviously when you're on a proper site they tend to frown upon that so <laughs> it's crawl under the van time to screw this on. Cool. Don't put your back out poorly, that's the last thing we need. Oh, it's off to a bad start because I'm nowhere near. <laughs> Oh. <laughs> I thought it was a good effort putting that carpet there. <laughs> Don't get stuck. <laughs> You've got to get up. <laughs> Come on, Annie, you can do it. Can you pass me a beer? <laughs> <laughs> Annie's up. Hey, well, thanks for your help. <laughs> oh, brilliant. <laughs> Sweep me carpet off. Yeah, carpet down. We like to have a civilised entrance. <laughs> oh. I think I was quite graceful, haven't I? <laughs> Very graceful. Oh dear. Paulie's been doing all the uh, manly things. I've been doing the things that's important to me. So this is uh, obviously in my charging station. High tech. If anyone that goes camping, um, cable ties are... You need them everywhere. So we've constructed a little bit of electricity coming out of our cupboard. So I've got a double little extension there. My GoPro charger, phone charger. Yeah, and as I'm a woman of a certain age, a very important piece of kit. A little fan. <laughs> so this is our end bed. Now this was actually a U-shaped lounge, but um, what we've decided to do, we've made it into just a fixed end bed. So, um, and it's lovely, it's big, big and comfortable. Um, and then we've got our little sitting area here. But we'll show you more in the van as we go along. Well, and that's poorly done by the looks. He's already got a can of cider in his hand. That's all my work, all my manly work is now officially done. <laughs> and now it's over to Carol to look after me for the next three days. <laughs> I don't uh, remember that in the agreement. So I get on with that. <laughs> so, first time in the camper van. I think we've had to use this for a long time. Sorry. <laughs> this is quite a dramatic news bulletin from Mrs. <laughs> Carol Morgan Slater. Yes, new nice news at ten. <laughs> so yes. Yeah, so as you can see, we've got fantastic weather. So yeah. very important. But we don't have to use it very often in England. So woo. So Carol's got that. I've got that. Oh yeah, she's naughty. It's only what time? Three o'clock. 
It's 10 o'clock in the morning, but no, no, it's no, not. No, it's not. <laughs> uh, happy days. Lovely. So, meet our traveling companions. Not an owl. <laughs> And you can't really, you haven't got glasses on again, have you? Hang on. Hang on. <laughs> ah, there it is. I thought you meant Fred and Percy Bomers. And because, of course, we are in Bomer Cider Country. Not country. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and that's his second one. I don't think he needs any more. Take two. <laughs> <laughs> Take three. <laughs> and look what we got here. Meat. Holly Dolly! Hello, you can say hello! Hello! <laughs> and Sky Pie! Say hello, Sky! <laughs> ah. Right, uh, it's been... Paulie's got his pole out. It's been 25 years. <laughs> it's been a while since uh, we got the awning out, so let's see. Let's see. She says, look <laughs> at the camera, and then she points it at the ground. <laughs> let's see if it works. <laughs> I thought you might need your glasses. Ooh. There you go, look. That's, uh, so we can put that away for another year, though. <laughs> hey, thanks for watching. No, put it out. Put it out. Why not? Because then we'll have to clamp it down and do this and do that and we don't we don't need it today. <laughs> yeah. After a few snacks and a catch up with Nat and Al, we decided to take the dogs for a walk and explore the site. Luxor Caravan and Camping Park has 106 pitches set over 21 acres and is nestled on the banks of the River Wye. Another great feature of Luxor is the shaded walkway. This takes you around part of the site and is ideal for dog walking. What's on the menu then, Pauly Morgan? Got some cider. Mm. And Chef Extraordinaire over there is going to knock us up some uh, pepper steak grills. And we got some, um, we like to pan around, we got some, I'm sure they're going to be very crispy. Oh, pork bellies. Mm. And even though Paul's still sat in the field, he's still watching football. What have you got to say for yourself? Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> After a delicious barbecue, we headed off to the river to watch the sunset.
After watching the sunset over the river, we headed back to our camper. Let me put this through any. Maybe it was the swan who done it. Carol doesn't seem to realise what time the sun goes down. <laughs> it took a bit longer than we thought. <laughs> I see you never know, by the time we get back, maybe that now on the breakfast rubbish. We're all snuggled up because it's, uh, as my little boy used to say, it's bed night time. And uh, we've had an excellent first day at Luxor and uh, we're thoroughly looking forward to tomorrow. We are. No, first impression's excellent. Isn't yeah, it? very good. Really good. Clean site, um, big, a lot bigger than yeah, we thought, isn't it? Very, very well. You know, manicured we all, yeah man, yeah, we yeah. All together very nice but there's touring caravans here there's static caravans there's different types of accommodation which we'll take you around and we'll show you all around the site um over the next couple of days so we're off to peeperson now aren't yeah. we <laughs> so nine night all night. and we'll see you tomorrow